guys, I just want to show you the proper way to get your dog into a car. If you don't have a ramp and you're needing to lift them. So first, <clears throat> you want to get them to put two paws up. And if they're not at that step, then you can use some treats to encourage them up every step of the way and work until they can do that. And then what you want to do, a lot of times people want to just lift from here and keep the dog up. And basically, it's really uncomfortable for the dog and it's the hardest for you uh, weight-wise. And um, Anyway, so what you're going to do is do a nice squat, bend and scoop the back legs, and then in. And then what you're using is, so you're doing a squat, hinging up, it's nice and easy. But when you squat, you want to make sure your knees don't go past your ankles, your knees back, you hinge here at your hips, you squat down, and make sure you're not like this or like this, you want to keep your legs parallel. I learned all that from a physical therapist, so how to do a proper squat. So that will help if you need to lift your dog, a larger dog, into a car that you can't quite carry or you're just helping boost them up.